on down in box number two. So we're just about right. Juliet Echo, 240 now, continuing to firm right in. And if she gets away with them, well, she's going to be very hard to beat. Just about set. Green lights on for race number four. Lua's running. So the outside boxes dominate the market. They're set. Ready, racing. Now the outside pair began only fairly. More speed, Silkworm's going to lead. Two lengths on Hurricane Evie. Getting into bother there, Juliet Echo. Up making very good ground. Firecracker Miss now challenging. Takes over from Silkworm. Then came Hurricane Evie. A gap to Juliet Echo. A King Percy and a gap to Destini Ninja. But breaking clear, Firecracker Miss. And she's going to explode away. She won by three to Hurricane Evie. Silkworm ran third. King Percy fourth. Juliet Echo, no luck today for her. And the same can be said for Destini Ninja. They were slow away and always battling from that point on. Number five, Firecracker Miss. For Gary Pigeon takes it at big odds. Loomed up down the back and race clear, defeating Hurricane Evie number one. And Silkworm number three, four is third. King Percy gets fourth. And the two that they backed here, Destini Ninja and Juliet Echo, were both poorly away today. And uh, they had no chance, really, down the back straight. 22.79 the run. It's uh, just outside of her PB. 7.20 the early section. Or the run home was strong, 12.56. And she broke right away, number five, to win by three lengths for Gary Pigeon. Three lengths, the winning margin. Five, one, four, and two. After race number four here from headquarters, we stand by for the all clear. Race five starts the quaddy. And that's up next.